week. Uh, it's a pretty fun week with quite a few freebies in both stores. So gonna try to go through them without issue, but I am gonna give you an early heads up that our main internet went down today. That's life in the country. So trying to stream this through my husband's phone. We'll see. So if I disappear, be patient. Hopefully I will come right back. Or we may just, you know, throw our hands up and give up at some point, but hopefully that's not gonna happen. So to dive right in, we're gonna start with CVS and then we're gonna go through Walgreens. Um, at the end, I do have the official CVS Black Friday ad. They just sent it to me from corporate this morning. So I thought we would both do a perusal of that ad together um, really quick just to see what we're gonna expect for Black Friday. I do know the deals are running all week long. Uh, I was hoping to look at it before we went live, but I kind of ran out of time today. Um, so to start off, we've got a lot of fun freebies and this one is back. This is the same deal. You can tell the stores are getting a little low on items. Um, same deal we've seen for the last three weeks. Buy two paparazzi nail polishes for $5 and get $5 back. Um, you can do this deal twice. So you can grab four, you'll pay $10 and you will get $10 back. So if they still have some, I mean, you might as well guys. This counts towards your beauty club new threshold in terms of earning your free product as well. They're not super exciting, um, but it is counting towards that. So, hey, you know, if you really wanted some other freebies, you can go that route too. Um, Lynn has a question. So at CVS, if I have a $4 off $40 purchase coupon, do I have to back out all my other store coupons before reaching? So yes, that four off 40 typically comes off last. So you would end up needing to still owe $40 to be able to use it. I don't know that you're gonna wanna end up doing that unless you go big and you decide to do the buy 30 and get 10. I actually would have hit it this week, Lynn, because I grabbed a couple deals and I'll share as we go through. Um, but you would need to have kind of a larger out of pocket than you may want to do. So free nail polish. Another paparazzi deal just to keep the brand together here, but most hand sanitizers this week at CVS are on sale for 29 cents. And these little paparazzis are included in that. So these are in the travel section in my store. They're really cute and really small. So if you're looking for some fun stocking stuffers, 29 cents isn't a bad price. CoverGirl, this week buy $18 and get $6 in rewards. So last week it was a little bit better of a deal. Buy two and get a $6 reward. So the 18's a little higher. But I did wanna mention one deal. For the last, well, ever since I got my CVS coupons back, every week I have had a store coupon for $8 or $6 off of this CoverGirl Olay Simply Ageless. I've never purchased it, but they are pushing it hard with a store coupon. And it happens to be the $18 that you need. So if by chance you have that store coupon, um, whether it's a $6, whether it's an $8, it still makes for a pretty sweet price. You're gonna get $6 back in rewards. If it's an $8 paired in with a $2 manufacturer, between $10 there in coupons and the $6 reward, you're paying $2.99. If your store coupon is a $6, you're paying $4.99. No, it's not free, but compared to that $18.99 price, it's really not a bad price. So just in case you have those same store coupons that I do. Uh, we have an unadvertised deal this week on soft soap. I kind of feel like this is CVS um, running the same deal that we're seeing in Walgreens or similar deal, similar products. So soft soap, hand soap, buy four at four for $10 and get a $5 reward back. So no coupons here, you're basically getting four for $5 or $1.25 a piece. We do have a 50 cent printable that is on the Soft Soap website. So that is on the CBS list on Southern Savers as well. You can print that coupon. Uh, just assuming you can print one of them. Um, I'm gonna just assume you're not gonna have the magical powers to get multiple there. You're gonna come out paying 93 cents a piece. So not a bad price um, for these larger 11 ounce hand soaps. Now there's something else included. Uh, oh, I thought I had stuck them there, um, but I guess I didn't include the picture, but soft soap 
three count bars are also included. So if you want to mix and match, you don't want to get all hand soap, you could grab some Irish Spring bar soap, three count bars. Uh, are included in that sale. Now, Irish Spring Body Wash has its own deal this week. We've got a $1 digital on any Irish Spring and a $2 reward. That's $3 in savings and it's on sale for $3.99. So you're gonna pay 99 cents for Irish Spring Body Wash after the coupons and after the rewards. Kind of fun price if that is something you will use. Nivea Body Wash also has a deal this week by two get a $5 reward. It's really all Nivea body care. So lotions included, the shave gels included, whatever you wanted to go to. But we've got a $3 off two coupon for Nivea body wash. That's a recent insert. So let's just say you wanted to go body wash here. That's an $8 savings on both of them, uh, or basically $4 a piece. So you're going to pay $2.29 for that Nivea men body wash after your $3 off two coupon and your $5 off two reward. Check your store coupons. I don't have one this week, but I do regularly get a store coupon off of any body wash, soap, etc., and that would pair in. So just see what you've got. Um, Ivory, this is one of the deals that I grabbed. Now, it may not seem that super exciting to you, but I actually need 50 bars of soap this week. We are packing 50 Operation Christmas Child boxes, uh, and I realized that soap was the one thing that I was really short on. Um, so I did this deal, it got me to 40. I'm still $10, 10 bars short, but it's okay, I'll find another deal. So this particular deal, they're on sale, buy one, get one half price, and when you buy four of them, you get a $10 reward. It doesn't make them free, um, but it does make them the best price possible. So this is a 10 bar pack and you're gonna end up paying $2.96 a pack after the sale and the reward. It's 29 cents a bar, um, by far the best price that you can get. And these are awesome for Operation Christmas Child boxes. Um, gold, gold Bond Lotion this week. This is not the Gold Bond products that are in the first aid aisle, but all of the lotion products that are in the skincare aisle are buy 20 and get $10 back in rewards. And we've got new $2 and $1.50 coupons for Gold Bond. So grab two of them. Um, this men's right here is $10.79. Grab two, use two $2 off coupons and a $10 reward, that's $14 in savings on what is basically a $21.50 purchase. Um, so you're gonna end up paying about six bucks for both of them or $3 a bottle. That's a great price. Again, if you have a store coupon off of any lotion, pair that in and it's gonna make this deal even cheaper. Um, I had a store coupon this week for any gold bond, strangely enough, so it could make that deal even cheaper. Um, oh, and Carrie, how exciting. Carrie says, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I've been a Walgreens fan the last two weeks. That's really how it works, Carrie, is they give you one or two great coupons and then you realize all of a sudden you're a little hooked. Uh, that's what happened to me about a year ago. I went from never shopping Walgreens to almost shopping Walgreens every single time. Um, so yeah. And I, I agree, Lynn, I wish those nail polishes could go in Operation Christmas Child boxes. I would be totally set, but they cannot. It is considered a liquid. Um, so deodorant, uh, we've got a lot of choices here. Axe spray, uh, Axe deodorant if you want. The spray is cheaper in a lot of stores. Or Dove, they're both part of the same deal. Buy two at buy one, get one half price and get a $3 reward. But we've got a lot of coupons here. You've got insert coupons, you've got printable coupons, you have Ibotta offers, and you have Fetch offers. Um, I mean, they are begging you to buy Axe or Dove Men Plus Care products. So you should. Uh, after all of those offers, these products come out to be free. So whatever you decide to get there, you've got a really high value coupon on Dove that was just, or Dove Men, that was just in Sunday's paper. Axe, you've got printables. Again, both of these have Ibotta and Fetch offers. Crazy good prices. This deal is a limit of one, so you're gonna have to pick which brand you wanna get, but they will be free. So enjoy that one uh, and all of the magical stacking that is happening on those products this week. 
Um, toothbrushes, this is a two pack. Um, so I, I normally wouldn't get excited about a 99 cent product, but there's two toothbrushes in there. So Oral-B two count packs are on sale this week for $4.99. Do you see this regular price? Like that's almost half price at this point. So they're on sale for $4.99. When you buy two of them, you are gonna get $4 back in rewards. And we've got $2 off coupons. You have a $2 digital and you have a $2 insert that was in the PNG insert from 1031. So grab two of those $2 off coupons. You're gonna end up paying uh, $2.99, or sorry, paying 99 cents a piece. You'll pay basically $2.99 as you check out, uh, but then you're gonna get back a $4 reward. So 99 cents a piece for the twin packs, basically 49 cents a piece for each toothbrush. Um, we'll have free toothbrushes here at Walgreens in just a second, but that's still a great price. CVS does not often give us free toothbrushes, so if you are a CVS person, you take what you can get. Now, if you have a store coupon off of any toothpaste, toothbrushes, or mouthwash, which is a regular, this is gonna add in. This may not be to the threshold that you need, but there are some other great oral care deals that you could pair with this to be able to use that store coupon if you needed to. So we've got a lot of great hair care deals. Elvive being the first, we've got a new $3 off to Elvive coupon that was in Sunday's paper. We have a digital here that's a $1. Don't get excited about the digital. I really, really want you to use the insert. You're gonna have a much better deal. So use that three off two coupon from Sunday's paper. You're gonna pay $5 and you're gonna get back three. That makes each one of these $1 a piece. Now I took a picture of just the purple line, but this is all of the LV products. So $1 a piece after that insert coupon. You've got Tresemme for $1.50 a piece. You still have that five off two coupon from two Sundays ago now. It expires this week. So use your $5 off coupon. You're gonna pay $5 and get back $2 in rewards. So $1.50 a piece after the sale and the reward. Again, these would be great to pair together if you had a store hair care coupon to make those deals even cheaper. And Garnier Fructis, we've got a new $3 coupon here. So a $3 off two from the inserts. Use that $3 off two coupon. You're gonna pay $4 and get back $2 in rewards. So these are also $1 a piece, just like the L'Oreal Elvive. So together, that is $28 worth of, or no, sorry, $25 worth of hair care. So if you have a store hair care coupon, that's totally gonna be enough for you to be able to use that, you know, four off 20, three off 18, whatever store coupon you have. If we're talking a four off 20, in the end, you're paying seven bucks for each of those deals all together. So you can see how great that's gonna be. You use your store coupon, you're now paying $3 for all of those hair care deals together. So those are the top three that I would aim for. One other one just to mention, because we do have some stacking offers on this, um, but OGX, we've got printable coupons for OGX. We have a digital. We also have Ibotta offers for this particular brand. So if you love this brand or you've been wanting to try it, they're on sale this week, buy one, get one 40% off. You've got $1.50 on Ibotta that you can use multiple times. You've got a $2 off two printable. It looks like the printable has met its limit. So if you didn't already print it, can't get it now. Um, or you have that as a digital. So after all those coupons, you will pay $2.45 a piece for what is normally an $8.70 product. So enjoy that one if it's a brand that you will use. Uh, one other on the hair care aisle is uh, clear all I, you know this is more a if you need it kind of deal it's not free but we do have a new six dollar off two digital so that's in your cvs account everyone has that store uh, sorry that manufacturer's coupon so you're gonna pay nine dollars for both of them and you're gonna get back two dollars in rewards so in the end you're basically paying seven dollars for both of them that's less than the price than one of them and you're getting two so enjoy it. Also make sure on this one that you are, uh, well, obviously you have to use your CVS card, but make sure that you are part of the CVS hair care program because they're going to track you. And when you purchase seven hair care, hair color products, sorry, you're going to get the eighth for free. And that's mix and match across all the brands. So if you regularly color your hair, it makes for a pretty sweet price. So um, just, you know, one to not miss. 
Okay, so, um, sorry, I lost my comment box trying to pull it back up here so that I can make sure I'm not missing any questions. Um, Oh, and Carrie, yes. So Carrie's saying on the, the Axe and the Unilever deodorant, those would, those would be great stocking stuffers or Christmas presents. You know, if you've got teenagers that are away at college, making them baskets of things that they don't have to buy themselves, it's still a pretty sweet gift. Um, so grab the free deodorant. Never, ever miss free deodorant. Um, and yes, Lynn, I think someone answered you. You do need to pay... Uh, the shipping charges on each shoebox. So with the shoebox, that that helps them get it overseas. These are not usually staying nearby. I know last year, all the boxes that we packed ended up in Indonesia. So to get a shoebox to Indonesia for nine bucks is actually a pretty good deal. Um, but that's what you do need to aim for. For all the ones that we are packing, um, we are kind of get some other family members to help provide for that because we're really packing all of these with uh, our American Heritage Girls troop. So it's not really all, I couldn't afford $9 for 50 boxes, but I definitely try to grab all the deals to help them pack the boxes. Um, and then they help the rest of the way. So cereal this week, Walgreens does not have a deal. So CVS is winning on the cereal side. They have General Mills cereals on sale for $1.99 and we have a $1 off two digital coupons. So use that CVS digital coupon. Uh, you also may have a printable. It is gone now, but if you did grab that, you can check and see if it is still good. Either of those offers, it's going to make it $1.49 a box for cereal, which is by far the best price that you're going to find on cereal this week. So enjoy the deal. Paper goods wise, this was an unexpected find for me, and it's kind of exciting because we need it to be literally this product. So this is Angel Soft Scented Tube six mega roll that's what you want and it's on sale this week for four dollars and nine cents head to the cvs list on southern savers because we've got a one dollar and fifty cent printable on this product that is directly from angel soft's website so you're gonna pay three dollars and 49 cents for the scented tube angel soft that's what the coupon's for so i was kind of excited to see that that is what lined up with the sale um, another option for this, these are on same exact size, same exact product on sale for $5, a penny more at Publix. So if you get to your CVS and your CVS is sold out, you can still save that printable coupon. If you've got a Publix nearby, you'll be able to get them for $3.50 rather than $3.49, um, but you should be able to find them between both of those stores as a great way to use them. Uh, one clearance deal for you if you're interested. My CVS, I can't guarantee this is everywhere. Clearance deals are definitely regional uh, or even sometimes store by store. But my CVS literally had the entire CBD locked cabinet on clearance for 75% off. So just going to mention it. If it's something that you've been wanting to try or you already try and you like, that's about as cheap as you are ever going to find um, these pain relief creams. So enjoy it, I guess. Um, so that's it for CVS. I want to try to make sure. Uh, can you use the Axe coupons on the gift packs that they have? Scarlett, you know, that's a great question. Let me um, look at the fine print. So it does state on the Axe deodorant coupon that was in that save insert that it excludes twin packs and trial sizes. It does not mention gift packs. But my guess would be that it is not going to ring up as um, attaching correctly. So those gift packs definitely have a different barcode on them that I don't see that that coupon is really going to like. You could try it, um, but I would probably just stick with the regular old deodorants on that one. Okay. Um, Oh, and I agree. So Kathleen says a while back she lost all of her CVS coupons, and when they came back, they're all really, really high value. Uh, that's kind of how I felt since mine came back um, the beginning of, I guess, the beginning of October. So I've had CVS coupons again for like five weeks. Uh, how do you get your good coupons back? So CVS corporate would tell you, Kathleen, that they are based on what you buy. So those high values, what happens is that your account basically resets and it's like they throw away all your personal data. And so for the first couple of months, they're not giving you the coupons based on your shopping history. They're giving you the coupons based on you being a new shopper. So it's hard to get those perks back of high value coupons, um, but that's why they were so high. So now the more you shop, your coupons are based on the products that you purchase 
rather than just all of those really, really great offers. I don't think you want them to reset. I don't think you want to go months and months with no coupons again. Uh, it was just kind of a, you know, maybe view it as like a we're sorry gift. You got lots of great coupons there for a bit. Okay, so Walgreens deals. We have free Crest toothpaste and free Oral-B toothbrushes this week. They're on sale for $3, and when you buy two of them, you are going to get a $3 register award. We also have a $3 off two digital store or digital manufacturer's coupon that is in your Walgreens app. So load that digital coupon. You're gonna buy two, it's $6 worth. Use your $3 coupon, so you're gonna pay $3 and you're gonna get $3 right back in register awards. So super easy and completely free. And there's multiple varieties there on the toothpaste. And then you're looking for those $3 Oral-B toothbrushes. I just grabbed toothbrushes with mine. Um, Colgate, we also have freebies here too. We've got a new $2 off coupon that came out in Sunday's paper, but we also have a $2 digital. And so I want you to load the digital and use one insert coupon here. You can use two inserts and ignore the digital if you want, but you might as well use the digital. Uh, so one insert, one digital, that's two $2 off coupons. In the end, you're gonna pay $1.98 for both of them and get back $2 in Walgreens cash. So pretty sweet, uh, easy way to make those completely free. There is a different Colgate deal that um, will also come out to be free on the higher, um, $3.99 products, um, you're also gonna wanna use those $2 off coupons on that one. Now this is a month long deal, but I just wanted to mention it again because it really does come out to a great price. I haven't mentioned it in a couple of weeks, but not only do we have a $3 off two Crest coupon uh, that you're gonna use on your toothpaste or your toothbrushes, but we also have a $6 off four digital coupon and I encourage you to use it on this deal. So this is Oral-B Floss Picks. They're part of a buy 12 and get a $6 reward back. So buy four of them uh, and use your $6 off four coupon and you are gonna end up paying about 99 cents a piece. Um, and that's a pretty sweet price for floss pick. So just to throw that out there, you may find some others that are a little bit more. Uh, you'll also find a lot of other products that are part of this. Uh, if you're worried about maybe not hitting because you're gonna be a few pennies short, um, you could grab, a, there are $4 toothpastes that are also part of this deal, $4 toothbrushes and your six off four coupon works on all of those. So, you know, however you wanna work it. Uh, or actually math wise, my, math, my brain is not working. You're totally fine on this. $3.99 times four is well over $12. I don't know where my brain is. So grab four, use your $6 digital, use your $6 in rewards. That's $12 in savings right there. Um, and you're gonna owe 99 cents in the end. Okay, um, and Rochelle, remind, re, remind you again how the cash rewards work when paying with them and when getting cash rewards. So let's back up for a second. This deal is buy two and get $2 back in Walgreens cash. So I could pay with Walgreens cash on this deal if I had it because the deal is telling me to buy two. Now, if the deal, and we're gonna, let's pretend this is not a register award, let's pretend this is Walgreens cash, this deal tells you to buy $12 worth. If it was Walgreens cash, you cannot use Walgreens cash on it. You can use all the coupons you want, but you cannot pay with Walgreens cash because the computer would think that you were below the $12 that you needed and it would not give you new Walgreens cash. Now, this is a register award deal, but you get the idea. So if it's a dollar amount that it is requiring you to purchase, never pay with your Walgreens cash. If it's a quantity amount, like this guy, buy two, use any of the Walgreens cash that you have that you want to use and you're perfectly fine. What I typically do is I split my buggy into two uh, and I will put uh, you know, all the items that I cannot use Walgreens cash on in their own little transaction and all the items that I can in the second transaction so that I know that I'm safe. I just say no to using them on the first and I go ahead and I use them on the second and hopefully that will take away some of that frustration too. Um, Walgreens, does Walgreens have a pharmacy rewards program like CVS? They do not give you Walgreens cash on prescriptions at Walgreens uh, like they give you extra care bucks at CVS. It would be great if they did, but they do not have that program. 
Um, so Tresemme, these tags do not show this. This is the month long tag and my store has not changed them out with the week long deals. But Tresemme, the same deal we had last week is back this week. So it is buy two and get a $5 um, reward back. So you're gonna get a $5 register reward when you buy $10 worth of products. There's a few different deals that are part of this. So I'm gonna show you a few of them here. Patresame is one of them. We still have that five off two coupon from last Sunday in the paper, but you also have that $5 digital. So if you didn't use your digital last week, you can use it this week. Use your $5 coupon. You're gonna pay $5 and you're gonna get $5 right back in a register award. Um, so super easy and completely free. You should buy some Tresemme. This is also part of the deal. This is Garnier Fractis. It's on sale two for seven. Go ahead and buy three of them. The third one will ring up at $3.50. It will trigger the sale, even though you don't have a fourth item. All you have to do is just buy two to get the sale price, and then any others past that give you that sale price. So you're gonna buy three. That is $10.50 worth of Garnier Fructis. Use your $3 off two Garnier Fructis um, coupon. Also, you have a $1 digital. So you've got a $3 off two digital and a $1 digital. It's kind of like they knew you were gonna end up buying three. So $10.50, but then you have $4 in coupons. So your total due is $6.50, and you're gonna get back your $5 reward. So in the end, you're getting Garnier Fructis for 50 cents a piece. Pretty sweet price. Uh, they're a dollar at CVS, so Walgreens won uh, with that one and with it being all digital offers. Now, it's back. Uh, Axe and Dove, um, Dove Men are also part of this same deal. Now, because they're all the same, I have to buy them in separate transactions. The, the computer will only print one $5 register award per entire transaction when it's the same deal. So you've got to buy the Tresemme, finish checking out, get the $5 register award, buy the Garnier, get another $5 register award, do not use them to pay for the next deal. Doesn't roll, that's what we would call that. You, If you use it, the computer will see that you're using it and it will not print another one, which is what you're wanting. So I gotta split them up and I cannot use the rewards to pay for the next one either. But they're still great deals. So they're worthwhile in terms of grabbing and then just having a bunch of register awards, which, go happily with all the Walgreens cash. So you could grab all your Walgreens cash deals and then use your register awards to pay for them. Um, so here's our Axe deal, they're six bucks a piece. When you buy $10 worth, so you just need to grab two, um, you're gonna get that $5 register award. We've got our $3 off two inserts, we've got Ibotta's, we've got Fetch. Um, so in the end, you aren't, you aren't paying very much at all for these Axe products or for the Dove Men. Um, so with Axe, you're gonna come out to paying 25 cents a piece. On the Dove Men, if you have the $3 off coupon that was in this past Sunday's paper, so there was a $3 off men, Dove Men Plus Care deodorant coupon. If you've got that, use two of those $3 coupons, that's six bucks right there, plus you've got Ibotta, plus you have Fetch, which is another four bucks. So now you have $10 in savings, and you're gonna get back a $5 reward. The purchase only costs 12 bucks. So you are ahead $3 on that purchase. If you do not have the $3 off um, insert coupons, uh, it's not gonna come out quite as cheap, but it's still gonna be a great price. We do have a digital coupon this week for $2 off two any Dove, Axe, or Degree product. So you could just use the digital if you wanted to, but completely free plus a money maker with those insert coupons if you had those insert coupons. Um, so if the Tresemme Catalina doesn't print at the register, is there something we can show them in our Walgreens app to prove that you should have gotten one? Um, so Lynn, yeah, this is in the craziness of the Walgreens. Um, let me see if I can find it for you, but the new Walgreens ad that's not there, you can pull this up in your app. Um, you just pulling up Tresemme in your app isn't gonna do it for you because the actual product won't show the register award on the website because on the website it's not, um, you know, you can't get register awards. But if you go into the ad 
and then oh you can't see this drop down that's funny that it doesn't show up for you guys but on this drop down right here you can choose personal care that's what I'm choosing and with personal care um, you will see all of the current personal care deals and here's our Tresemme um, right there and it does tell you that you are gonna get uh, right here on this line earn five dollars in store rewards a register reward when you buy ten dollars or more so it is clearly in this week's ad even though there is no ad um, and it's all these are all part of the same deal so this is all five dollars off when you buy ten dollars or more products so hopefully that will help you um, but you shouldn't have issues on that one it printed just fine for me okay um, so again that's a lot of products that are all part of the same deal and they're all great deals so you do want to buy them separately and you do not want to pay with the register award to get the next deal you just want to save them and use them on another purchase and Rochelle asking what about cash rewards and getting register awards so register awards and Walgreens cash completely separate and will not affect each other in any way shape or form um, so they will affect themselves, like again, if I bought the Tresemme and then I tried to use that $5 register reward to help pay for the Garnier Fructis, I wouldn't get the reward again. It's kind of how, how Walgreens is tracking you to make sure that you don't repeat the same deal back to back. So they do mess with themselves, but I can totally buy all my register reward deals and get all those pieces of paper and then use those to buy my Walgreens cash with no issues they're happy as a lark for you to go back and forth between the two programs hopefully that makes sense it's like a quick answer um, our Revlon deal is back this week I want to give you an idea uh, if you did not buy this last week we still have really high value um, digital offers here so you've got an eight dollar off two Revlon face digital coupon it's a pretty sweet offer so grab two of them. Um, my store just raised the price on these. These were like $9.99 a couple weeks ago. But this is Candid, um, or actually this is the foundation now that I think about it. What you really want is the Candid um, concealer. So maybe the price didn't go up. Two Candid concealers at $9.99, not these foundations at $11.99. Two at $9.99 gets you what you need, gets you the $15 for the deal. You use an $8 off two digital coupon and use a Th or, sorry two three dollar off any face ibotta offers on revlon as well so after all of that and the five dollar reward candid concealer at 9.99 will be 49 cents a piece which is a pretty sweet price now really what you're going here for is two face products so if you don't want concealer one other cheap item would be blush at 11.49 but there's not a lot of face products that are cheaper than 9.99 so that concealer is probably your best bet. Two of those, use your $8 off two digital coupon, use two $3 Ibotta's. That right there is $14 worth of coupons and you're getting back a $5 reward. So pretty sweet. Um, you, should, you should totally grab that one. It's a great price. Um, and Ellen, uh, I agree. Oh, sorry, I did not mean to make your, uh, your <laughs> question show up there, Len. Um, I don't even know how to make it go away. Let's see, it's just happy. Um, there we go. Clicking buttons accidentally, but that's kind of fun. Don't ever do that one. Maybe I should, maybe I should do that more often. Um, yes, Walgreens is confusing. The best thing in terms of Walgreens to do is one deal at a time. If you're super overwhelmed or you're worried about messing up, just not going in and buying a bunch of things, um, you can make sure they're ringing up right. You can make sure the digital coupons came off right and not have to stress over what did I do wrong or what didn't work right? Um, and even for me, I'll tell, I'll show you my deal here in a minute, but uh, I did check out with some things. Actually, I, all I did was grab the free toothbrushes and then grabbed some toys, um, but even those didn't ring up right. So it still involved getting a manager over to make it all right in the end. So you also just have to be okay with that. If things don't work out, just this may take a little longer than we had planned, but we are going to get it fixed. Um, so let's talk razors uh, this week they're on sale buy one get one half off I want you if you did not do this deal last week if you have not used your digital coupons this is a great price we've really not seen Gillette and Venus um, super cheap in a while um, thanks PNG 
but we do have one $3 digital for men's razors and one $3 digital for women's razors. So to get the best deal here, I want you to get one of each this week if you have not used those, those digital coupons. We have no other coupons here, so those digitals are your only option. If you've used them, I would just hold off. We, we see new coupons once a month, so don't grab this if you don't have the coupons. But one of each here, use two of those digitals, one for the men, one for the women. That's $6 in coupons, and you're gonna get back a $10 Walgreens cash. Now, this is an example of a deal that I would not wanna pay with Walgreens cash on, uh, because I gotta buy $20 worth to get the reward. If you pay with Walgreens cash, you will not get the reward, so no Walgreens cash being used here, just those two $3 digital coupons. But after you get back your $10 in Walgreens cash, you're gonna end up paying about $2.11 a razor, which is a great price. So one men's and one women's. Now here's our soft soap deal. We've seen this in the past. This is the first time that you're not gonna be able to purchase it online and then pick it up in the store. It is cheaper online, which is always the hard part. But you wanna grab four soft soap um, hand soaps this week. They're on sale, buy one, get one half off. We've got a 75 cent digital and a 50 cent printable. So use those two coupons on your four products. Honestly, for the best deal, what I would do is grab one big guy and three of the smaller ones. It'll get even cheaper. Uh, the reason for the one big guy is your 50 cent printable does require that the hand soap be more than eight ounces. So these little guys won't work on the printable. They will work on the digital though. It will apply to them. So grab four of them. They're buy one, get one half off. Use those two coupons, which is worth $1.25. Plus you're gonna get back a $4 register award. So after the um, coupons and the reward, if and this is just for maths, for easy math sake, if, if all you did was grab the big guy, um, you would still get them for 93 cents a piece. But if you grab these little guys, that's gonna be even cheaper. I just didn't do that math out before we got started. Um, so best deal will be even cheaper than 93 cents a piece. One big guy, three little guys, and then using those two coupons, you're gonna come out to, my guess would be, um, you're basically saving 75 cents um, off the other one with every set of two that you grab. So um, it's not, not gonna be bad. You're gonna end up paying probably about 60 cents a piece. Um, fast math on that. So detergent deals and or paper goods. This deal comes out to be pretty sweet. So Tide Detergent, Tide Pods, Charmin Essentials, and Bounty, Bounty Essentials, either one. Grab four of those products. Um, oh, and Tide Pods, grab four. They're all on sale for $5.25. And when you grab four, you're gonna get a $6 register award. And we've got coupons. Uh, we've got printables, $2 printables on the Tide, we have $1 digitals on Bounty, $1 digital on Charmin, and we have a $2 printable or insert coupon on the liquid. So best scenario here is to grab three Tide products and one paper good, use three $2 off coupons and one $1 digital. So that is $7 in coupons and a $6 reward. That's $13 in savings between the coupons and the rewards you're gonna come out paying $2 a piece. Option B, grab two Tides, uh, a pod and a liquid, use your $2 printables, grab one Charmin, grab one Bounty. Um, so now you're paying with $6 in coupons. It's not really gonna lower your price that much. Instead of $2 a piece, you're gonna pay $2.25. So that is entirely using printable and digital offers. Very doable for a lot of folks. Um, but it does make for some great prices on paper goods and detergent. And um, we have a few other detergent deals, Purex. I don't know that I'd go running in for this one, but we do have a new $3 digital and a $3 reward when you buy two of them. Your digital is only good on one. Um, so they're on sale for $7.99. If you grab two after the coupon and after, after the reward, you're paying $4.99, which is about half price. Two other options, Purcell is on sale. We've got new $2 coupons that were in our inserts. We also have a $2 digital. So you're gonna pay $2.99 on that 40 ounce Purcell. And all is on sale for $2.99 and we have a new $1 coupon. We also have $1.25 printables. 
So you've got all as low as $1.74 or $1.99 using your digital offer. So lots of great detergent prices, uh, but honestly, your Tide is coming out to be just as cheap as the others. So you really can pick whatever brand makes you happy this week and get a pretty great price on all of them. Uh, another deal on toilet paper, Angel Soft um, is $3.99 this week. And we have new coupons here too. So you've got a 50 cent digital. So you're gonna pay $3.49. This is the exact same size that we're getting at CVS for $3.49. This one's just not scented. So if the scent drives you crazy, go to Walgreens. Same exact price, but I don't have to buy those lavender scented rolls. Um, Walgreens, you've also still got your Scott uh, Comfort Plus and your Scott Paper Towels. That's a month long deal. I haven't mentioned it in a few weeks, but you still have those too. So if you really needed to stock up on paper goods, you could grab those as well. Palm Olive. This is the little bottles. So we have a deal. We have a month long deal on our big bottles. And I've mentioned it, I feel like every week lately, but this week on the little bottles, this is the eight ounce. We have a 50 cent digital that is only good on these tiny bottles and they're on sale for 99 cents. So if you just need a tiny little bottle of detergent that are, sorry, dish soap, that is 49 cents after the digital coupon. So kind of a fun, um, little item to add in if you needed to. Um, so Imodium, Pepsid, and Lactaid this week, or sorry, just Imodium and Pepsid. I'm, my brain is thinking what the coupon is for. Um, we saw this deal a couple weeks ago. It's back. When you buy two of them, you're going to get a $5 register award. And this week we have new coupons. So they were just in Sunday's paper for Imodium and Pepsid. Um, so grab those coupons from, um, what I'm trying to, from the save and cert. Um, that was just this past Sunday. Some of you got $3 and some of you got $2.50 off. Um, so if you have uh, one of the $3, whatever one you have, use whatever you can find. Um, you also have a $2.50 printable here. So use a printable and an insert. The inserts are all a limit of one. So let's just go easy math and say you have two $2.50 coupons. That's $5 in savings with the printable and the insert and a $5 reward. So it makes some of these items super cheap. That's $2.99. Um, Pepsid is also part of that. The cheapest Pepsid in my store was $13.99. Um, so just to give you a big jump in price, but it's still a considerable savings to get that extra $5 off of each item. Also uh, to not forget, there is currently an online rebate for any $25 purchase in Aveeno, Neutrogena. It's really all these S.E. Johnson products. Uh, it includes Band-Aid, Benadryl, Imodium, Pepsid, et cetera. You buy $25 in those products and you are going to get a $10 gift card back. So if you wanted to, you really could stock up on Pepsid or a, a bigger box of Imodium and take advantage of that online rebate as well. Now, another deal to not miss. This is a month long deal, but the coupons just magically lined up this week. We've got new $2 off coupons in Sunday's paper. We also have a $2 printable. We also have a $2 digital and you have a $4 off store coupon. So math wise, there is not much left to pay after all those coupons, $6.49 minus your $4 store minus your $2 manufacturer. You're going to get Rolaids, um, tablets for 49 cents a piece. That's a great price for a 120 count bottle. So this one should definitely be on your Walgreens order. And by the way, guys, this could be in a pickup order because the two of those offers, the $2 and the $4 are digital. So I could, if I was going to do a Walgreens online in-store pickup order, add this to it. Uh, you're only going to pay 49 cents, no matter where you grab that in-store or online. Uh, a couple other deals to take advantage of that are not rewards deals. Um, Papermate, Expo, and Sharky, Shar Sharpie are all buy one, get one this week. And these could be fun for me. Um, I have five kiddos, guys. So normally for stocking stuffers, I will buy these multi-pack um, pen sets and I will split them all up. So I'm not trying to shove eight uh, pens all in one package in your stocking. I don't know if the package would even fit, um, but I'll get some of the larger packs or I'll get a few of these and then give everybody their favorite colors. Because I don't know about your family, but each of my kids has a favorite color. Um, and it makes for a great stocking stuffer. So these basically are coming out to um, the colorful ones are $1.49 a piece when you look at it with the buy one, get one sale. Remember with this sale, it is technically mix and match, but you really wanna pick either two of the same items 
or two items that are the same price because the cheaper one is the one that's going to be free. So uh, don't shortchange yourself on the deal by picking a really expensive item and a much less um, priced item because you're really not saving that much in the end. I want to go for two items that are the same price. Chocolates. Uh, if anyone has a grandmother like mine was, she this made her day. If all you gave her was a box of chocolates for Christmas, she was happy as a lark. So Whitman Samplers and the Russell Stover chocolates are on sale this week for $4.99. Same price at CBS, by the way, but Walgreens wins because Walgreens gave us a new $1 off digital coupon. And that coupon is actually for both brands. So you can only use it one time, but it does make them $3.99 for one box. So take advantage of that. That's as cheap as you will see for Whitman's samplers and the Russell Stovers, just to, you know, throw it out there. Uh, and sugar-free is also included in case you, you know, really want to watch out for grandma. For me, my grandmother, she lived until she was 96. If she wanted to eat chocolate at 96, you get to eat chocolate. No one's going to tell you what you can't eat at that point. Another candy deal. I never know how to say this. Toffafe, that's how we're going to say it. Um, Toffafe 30 count packs are on sale this week. That's the important part. On sale this week, two for $9. And we've got a $2 Walgreens digital coupon. It's only good on one box. You want to grab both of them. You do not want to only grab one. You want to grab both of them so you can get the sale price. Um, but in the end, you're going to get them two for seven or $3.50 a piece. So fun chocolate deals um, that can make for fun presents under the tree or in your stockings. Um, but those are definitely the best prices that we're seeing. Coffee-wise, we've got a, a $1 Folgers printable. It's still around. So if you haven't used your printable, Folgers K-Cups are $5.99 or the very large 30-ounce containers of Folgers coffee is $6.99. So use your $1 coupons, pay $5.99 for this big guy or $4.99 for the K-Cups if you love Folgers. Uh, now, here's our toy deal. This is actually what messed up for me this week when I checked out. This is a month-long deal. It's really going to go past. Uh, it'll go into December as well. They run this every holiday season. So this is all of their $6.99 toys are buy two and get one free. I went specifically looking for things that I could break apart to put in multiple Oper Operation Christmas Child boxes. Um, but this is where I made my mistake was this bluey right here because I have a six-year-old who will absolutely love these puzzles. This is included in this sale, but it is also on sale this week. So if you decide to take advantage of the sale, which you should, I used a lot of register rewards here. This is the perk of doing those register reward deals and multiple transactions. You don't have any coupons for these. These are great items to turn around and use all your $5 register rewards on. Um, but th that bluey being on sale for 25 cents and there are a couple other uh, toys that are also on sale this week being 25% off. Um, I think I said 25 cents, 25% off. It ends up negating the buy two get one. Um, so if you decide to grab this guy right here, I would actually wait. Uh, it will be, it'll be that buy two get one is going to keep running. So if you want a sale item, uh, because it's not just bluey, there are some others, do not grab a sale item this week along with other products. You really just want to wait. It is a better deal at buy two, get one free than it is at 25% off. So hopefully that makes sense. Um, that is where I went wrong. I finally convinced the uh, manager what happened and she did credit back. Um, so I did end up getting the sale that I wanted, but it's not gonna be the easy checkout that you want. So you might as well just wait until it is not on sale and then you don't have to sit there and argue with them. Um, but this is a perfect deal to add in and use your register rewards on and have some free gifts. Um, so I found a six count. They're kind of down here in the corner. This was a six count puzzles in little boxes. Perfect to split up. That makes six different toys for Operation Christmas Child. And then I found um, some smaller Hot Wheels sets and other items too. So there are some great toys there if you're still trying to pack boxes too. Um, okay. I'm trying to make sure. Does your Walgreens... Oh, do, um... Yes, Ellen. So the Walgreens Getting Started Guide, I, you know what? You're making me question. I don't know the last time I updated it. It may actually still call them balance rewards. I'll go back and I'll update it. It may not happen this week. I'm a little stressed with all the Black Friday ads. But if you can just mentally, Ellen, switch out balance rewards in your mind for Walgreens cash, 
they literally didn't change anything. So same exact rules between the two programs um, when they change the name of the program to Walgreens Cash, but it does explain it. Um, and we also did a how to shop Walgreens video a month ago. I would search for it on YouTube. It's a little easier to find than on Facebook, um, but there it's there on both of them. And I very slowly went through the differences of Walgreens Cash and Register Awards and some tips to use both of them. So watching that video may help as well because it's only you know a month old um, and very up to date on all of their various quirks and policies. So that should help too. Um, but I will put it on my list to update the Walgreens Getting Started Guide if I haven't already at least to check but I can guarantee you I won't get there this week with all the Black Friday ads that are currently out that we're busy typing. Okay, guys, that is everything that I had for you on the drugstore deals. I did promise that we would pull up um, our CVS ad. So let me pull that up really quick. I did just download it for you guys. Um, oh, I do have to change this really quick so you can see. Um, let's see. Oh, maybe we can go this way. We'll try that. Oh, no, now you're looking at something else. Um, preview. There we go. It's a CVS ad. Um, so this is CVS's Black Friday ad. I know it's getting smaller. Don't worry, I'll make it bigger. Um, and this way you can get, we're going to kind of get a, a glimpse together of what is going on. This is all week long. Um, and it looks like they're going to throw in just a flyer on the back few pages. So here's our Black Friday specific, four days only, Sunday to Wednesday. They did this to us last year, so be ready. Um, the reason I'm telling you this one, and we're kind of doing this preview now, I may even kind of stick this in its own little video later, is um, if we did a, a, a Tuesday video, none of these deals are still going to be there. So I will have these deals up tomorrow on Southern Savers. I normally post them on Thursdays, but I will post it tomorrow for all of the Black Friday deals. So it'll go up on Wednesday of what you can grab at CVS um, in terms of the various deals that are there. Um, not seeing a lot of freebies, but we do still have, these are um, our various gift sets that they've been running. They're a little cheaper than they have been. You'll have Pantene um, on sale. This is gonna come out to being um, a dollar a bottle for Suave. Um, let's see, trying to see if any of these, the same monofoil that's already running this week. So I'm not seeing any freebies, um, but hopefully in the rest of the ad, we're going to have some, I don't know, some better deals. Um, they did give us only a few freebies last year, so I'm kind of not surprised to not see anything super magical, um, in terms of looking through, but you at least have a glimpse of what that ad looks like. Um, and I'm always hesitant. Um, here we go. This is this looks pretty good. So Revlon appliances, you're gonna save 20 bucks off of them. So they'll be on sale, ten dollars off, and then you're gonna get another ten dollars back in rewards. So you could kind of be scoping out what you wanted in terms of Revlon appliances. And this is hair appliances that are regular retail of twenty dollars plus. You're gonna get a ten dollar reward back too. So that's a fifty percent savings on those products. Um, I'll make it small again. Um, these are just like you're getting my first impressions here on on all the deals. I'm not, none of them are really jumping out at me. Here we go. That's what we wanted. These are going to run all week long. Um, thank you, CVS, for not leaving us disappointed. So we're going to have free acetaminophen, free CVS baby wipes. We get that one every year. Free CVS panty liners every year as well. These are all a limit of one. Um, so hopefully that means your store won't be sold out on them. And these are in the full ad section. So they're going to start on Sunday and they'll run all the way until Saturday, really until they're sold out. So get ready for that one. We also have a high value gift card deal here by $75 worth of Applebee's and get $25 back in rewards, which is pretty sweet. Um, I think our only Applebee's closed down, so that's not very fun. Um, but it's still a pretty sweet price. Um, Edge and Skin and Mint Shave Gel, 99 cents. Um, not sure how long our Ibotta offer is going to hold out, but we do still have a $1 Ibotta on that. So if it is still around, that is also a freebie. Um, and all in Snuggle, buy one, get one. And you're going to get a $2 reward in my store. That's $6.99. So buy one, get one with a $2 reward makes both of them $4.99. We do have those printable coupons for all. So go ahead and print your coupons. Um, you're going to end up, 
paying, what is that? You're at $249 with the sale and the reward. So you use your $1.25 coupon and you're gonna pay $1.25 for all. Snuggle, we've got $1 off, so you're gonna pay two, uh, sorry, $1.49 for Snuggle. That's a great price for both of those two. Um, so I don't know. You, this is literally how my brain works as I go through ads. So you're, uh, it may be a little too fast for you. I don't know, but hopefully it helps to see some of these deals um, a little bit early. And I don't want to. Um, here we go. Free toothpaste, guys. This is another one of those. You don't have to use rewards. You're going to go to the coupon center. Everyone's going to have, or it'll be in your app. Um, that's what they're telling you here. So it's on sale for $3.99. Everyone's gonna have a store coupon for $3.49 off, and everyone's gonna have a 50 cent manufacturer. So they're telling you to pair the store and the manufacturer together, which is how it works, and it's gonna be completely free for you with digital coupons. So that is Colgate Optic White, Total, Max, or two-in-one toothpaste. So that's fun. I do feel like there's you know, a few freebies worth grabbing here. Um, let's see gonna probably call it after this page but seeing a few things that are all part of a big png buy three and get five or buy fifteen dollars and get five there's a couple different deals um let's go full screen and then lots of food sometimes cvs gets boring with the things too that they give to us every single week okay and we're back to the top again so hopefully this helps you guys get a glimpse of that there are some freebies free toothpaste free acetaminophen free wipes free panty liners, um, along with some pretty cheap all detergent snuggle uh, and probably some pretty good paper goods as well. So I will have all of that matched in with all the coupons up on Southern Savers tomorrow. So if you go to southernsavers.com slash CVS, it will show up as another ad. So just to come back and show you this again, um, if I'm on the CVS page right here, we've got multiple tabs. Tomorrow, there'll be a third tab that shows next week's ad so that you can start to get a good glimpse of what those freebies are going to be early. Um, the free items do go quickly, so you really don't want to wait until a Tuesday video. I'm probably not going to be able to do a Tuesday video next week anyway. We are, I think, going to be hopping in the car about that time to try to miss some traffic to go visit the in-laws. So, um, you know, your little preview right there might be all I'm able to give you. I may try to do a live video just spur of the moment over the weekend too if there are some other deals that I didn't catch in that quick preview there. So I hope that this helps you guys both this week and next week. Walgreens wise, we're not gonna have much of a preview. They'll they'll give us their weird adness on uh, tomorrow. I don't know. I'll see what we can make out of it. Uh, and I, I will try my best to do a live video at the end of the week to get you ready for both of those stores. I will warn you, last year, Walgreens completely ignored that it was Black Friday. So that's kind of what I suspect for next week. It's just a normal week for them with normal week type deals, but nothing in terms of massive amounts of freebies. They haven't done that for a few years now. It's really just CVS that's still giving us some fun ones to grab. So uh, again, hopefully this helps. Feel free to send me a message uh, through Facebook or an email, Jenny at southernsavers.com, and I will try to help if you have other questions as well. So thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you have a great rest.